Hi there. Welcome to this another episode of Tech Sundays. And in this episode, we are going to discuss two very important Dex functions. That means we are going to compare replace Dex function with substitute Dex function. Replace Dex function replaces a part of a text string with another text string. However, substitute Dex function replaces the entire text string with another text string. So that's the main difference between them. But their working is quite similar. And in this video, I'm going to let you know with an example that how you can use them. Also, if you are over here for the very first time, please consider subscribing our channel and hit the bell icon for all the latest videos and updates. So let's get started. Let's first have a look at the definitions of these two text functions. Replace text function is going to replace a part of a text string with a different text string. And its syntax says you have to first write your text function name that is replace, then your old text string, then you have to also mention the starting position. This is very important because it works on the position of a character. So from where you want to replace a certain text into the string, you should be aware about the position of that particular text. Then you have to count the number of characters of the string that you want to replace and then you have to mention your new text. It's going to return single string value, the resulting string after applying the replacements. Here you should note that the start position starts from 1 for the first character in the string. It doesn't start with zero. Now coming to the substitute text function, it's going to replace existing text with a new text in the text string. Again, the syntax is pretty simple over here. You have to first write your text function name, which is going to be substitute. Then you have to write the text, then old text and the new text. Now it's going to return a single string value. And also you would get your modified string as a return value. Remember, use the substitute function to replace specific text in a text string only. Use the replace function to replace any text of a variable length that occurs in a specified location in a text string. So if you know the location of your text, then you can use the replace text function. The substitute text function is a case sensitive. If case does not match between text and the older text, substitute function will not replace the text. So suppose you have a capital or small letter difference, please make sure that you are writing the right text to replace it. Otherwise, it's not going to work. Now, in a demo, we are going to have a look how to use that. And for that, I'm going to use Dex.2 website. So let's head over there. Now, as you can see that I'm currently on my Dex.2 website. Over here, first we are trying to have a look at the replace dex function. How does it work? For that, I have defined two variables, well and replacement. My first variable has a text string which is saying subscribe BI Consulting Pro YouTube to learn Power BI and DAX. And I want to replace BI Consulting Pro with PCP. In this case, we should know first the position of the character for the very first string. Over here, B is going to start at position 11 as it starts from the 1 and also the text string that I would like to replace that is BI Consulting Pro we should know the length of this text string over here the length is going to be 17 characters and you can count it from here 1 for B 2 for I and then there's a space 3 and so on then this is going to be 17 characters long string now we would like to replace it with the replacement variable which is PCP. So at the bottom you can see that I'm using this evaluate text function again. Over here I'm going to evaluate my original text where my value is gonna come from the first variable. Then I'm going to replace it with my BCP which is my replacement text string. So if you hit this button over here to run it, you would see your return value over here. So here I can clearly see that the BI Consulting Pro has been replaced with the BCP only. So that's how you can use this replace DAX function. Now let's move on to substitute DAX function. 
In this case, I have this small piece of code where I'm getting top 10 product names and I would like to replace the product that is starting with the Contoso with the BCP. So let's do it over here. I'm going to just hit this run button and here you can see that Contoso has been replaced with BCP in a new name. Now, remember, as I just mentioned, if it's not going to match the cases of a text string, it's not going to work. For example, in this case, suppose Contoso is going to start with a C as a capital letter, but let's replace this with a small letter and see whether it's going to work or not. I'm going to again hit the run button and here you can see that Contoso is coming the same because substitute dex function is a case sensitive dex function and it won't work if you won't match the cases of a characters in a text string. Now I have just replaced it with the capital character again and let's run it again and here you can see that it has substitute Contoso with the PCP. So guys that's how you can use these two dex functions wherever you would like to replace or substitute a text string in a measure or maybe in a calculated column that totally depends on your requirements. I hope now you know the difference between replace and substitute dex function and also you know how to apply them. If you have any questions or concerns please don't forget to connect with us and also for more exciting videos don't forget to subscribe our channel and hit the bell icon. See you in the next video.